but I got a 7,000 pound axle to go under this thing and I want a utility trailer that will be able to support 7,000 pounds. So that way, you know, if something happens, you know, at the very least I have a uh, 5 by 10 utility trailer that I can put probably about 5,000 pounds of carrying weight on. Still working, lights check out, wheels are torqued, life seems good. I'm pretty confident about this. You know, obviously if I wasn't, I wouldn't be doing it. But um, it's always a little nerve wracking the first time you take something like this out on the road. So wait for a few more cars to go past and, uh, and we're off. So I'm thinking this trailer might be a candidate for some shock absorbers because it has a 7,000 pound suspension and it weighs maybe a thousand pounds. So uh, it's a little jouncy, just a tad when we hit bumps, and I feel like some shock absorbers would kind of make that a little bit better. But uh, if that's the biggest problem we have, I mean, friggin' rights, man, we did it. First time at 60, all good. We're on a really curvy road right now, and it's staying back there just fine. Better not be 203, I just paid 204. Is that a five? I can't see, there's a stoplight that covers the top. That is a 203. Oh, are we going the one we didn't go in? All right, this is getting ridiculous. So we're gonna hit up the scales. I feel like I'm the TFL truck guys now. <laughs> My money says this thing weighs 1,500 pounds. That's what I'm betting on, maybe 12. I don't think, I don't think anymore. But obviously, I don't know, and that's why we're here. 1365. 1365, all right. Okay, so let's see. This whole rig weighs 10,480 pounds with the trailer, minus, minus the truck only weight of 8980, which is evidently what my welding rig weighs, which is more than I thought. 1,500 pounds exactly. It's probably within like 10 pounds or something, because the scales don't measure like a 50th of an ounce. But basically 1,500 pounds right on. How about that? Dang, I'm good at this game. All right, so we found out what this thing weighs. Now I have to take that and uh, some other paperwork to get this thing registered. And I think we can call this build a success because we uh, everything's gone really well so far. Zero issues on the towing front. And um, yeah, life's good. 
So, thanks for watching, everybody.